bought a Game Boy Color. Oh, yeah. All right, well, I brought a bunch of stuff, so let's go through this, and I'm gonna ask you questions while you... Like, what are you looking for before you send a book? This one also is missing a huge chunk. No! <laughs> What's up, everybody? I'm here for a video that, well, I know a lot of you are excited for. It's a toy hunt. <laughs> Ego, ego, me and my ego Hear no, see no, speak no evo We a team, yo, yeah, you know how we roll He said I'm a star, I should be the lead role uh, I'm sure the title of this video, the thumbnail of this video, and the promotion of this video all told you what it was. We are doing a toy hunt. Follow me on social media on everything, every platform. X is at official ego. Instagram is at official underscore ego. And Alpha One Wrestling is at A1 Wrestling across the board. On this channel, we stream live events, guys. May 19th is the next event. It's massive. It's huge. But for the people that love the toy content, this one's for you. And April 28th at 8.30 p.m. on Whatnot, go to auctionego.com to sign up for that, to set a reminder and a bookmark or whatever it is, the blah, blah, blah. Anyways, we're doing a live stream, live auction. Ethan Page signing autographs, signing upper deck cards, signing action figures, selling shirts, ring-worn gear, lots and lots and lots of epic stuff on Whatnot. Okay. All the business and BS out of the way. Now it's time to do the fun stuff. The toys. The collection. What have I been getting myself into? Lots. I did take a bit of a hiatus. Wasn't really buying much. Sold a bunch of my collection to a toy store in Michigan. But then I found my way into another rabbit hole of things that I'm enjoying and wanting to collect. So this video is actually about two topics. Uh, one of those topics being graded comics. All right, we are at State of Comics in Plymouth, Michigan, and I met these guys at where, where were we? Flint. Really Flint. Cool. Yeah, really. Well, I, th I feel like I met you guys at Motor City Con. Maybe. Well, at least the big man I met at Motor City Con for sure. <laughs> we uh, we reconnected. I picked up a comic book from you guys. That's the TMNT book, right? Yeah. 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 So we haven't sent that one off to get graded yet, right? No, it's off. Oh, you did send it I off. Did send it. Yep. Yeah. Oh, dang, okay. All right, well, I brought a bunch of stuff, so let's go through this, and I'm gonna ask you questions while you rifle through these books. The movie adaptation. So a lot of these have nothing to do with value. Yeah. <laughs> I like, oh, the, like you just said, yeah, right away. No, I, this is, I mean, we've sold this book in this shape for like 15, 20 bucks. Can't go wrong with Batman forever. I think uh, those ones might have, some of them have double-sided, I don't know, or two books in one. Yeah, yeah, that's definitely the trade. Yeah, those Marvel comics. These are these are definitely good books. It looks in good shape too. Yeah, Blood and Thunder is in pretty, pretty good shape. I don't know. I'm just guessing. So what is like? What are you like? What are you looking for before you send a book? Well, it depends on what you're grading it for. If you're not grading it for value, you just want. Yeah, 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 for, yeah. For the purpose of keeping it protected, protected. Yeah. And it doesn't really make a difference. Okay. Typically, like spine ticks, uh, color rubs, uh, folds. Folds. Creases, anything that breaks color. Blunted corners and stuff. So there's a, there's a slew of different things. Like this one's got a couple of spine ticks here. Uh, oh, so even along the side, okay. No way. Whoa! Gee, okay. Okay, so I wanted to ask you about this. Okay. So I bought these forever ago. I've had these books. I put those in these weird frames probably 10 years ago. Okay. I don't know if the frames made the books worse. So other people that have also done this, I'd love to get your opinion. Please, 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 take it out. Let me make sure my kid isn't breaking something. Hey, what are you doing over here? Oh, a Mario car? Ooh, ooh! They got a Ninja Turtles one over here too. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Turtles. Oh, uh, this one definitely was definitely affected. Some so, way. so is this one. 
Really? Condensation. Well, and you can see the entire cover in okay. the but that's probably because of condensation. Right. Oh yeah, you can. But this one you can tell looks like the oh, condensation has got water damage because of the condensation inside. This one also is missing a huge chunk. No! Of <laughs> I did not, not know that. It's not condensation. Yeah. yeah they have these. They're essentially the same thing. Oh. They're not glass and they have UV protection. So it's a frame for like a raw book? Yeah. Whoa, so can, okay. I believe you can fit the bag and board in there too. Cool, okay. But because that this one piece is ripped, that'll affect the grade for, for sure. sure. Yeah, for sure. Oh, okay, all right. So th this one is obviously better than the one I have. It's, yeah, I mean, they're tangible because this one has a little bit of schmutz down here and this one's got this big color break fold so okay. this this can be pressed that can't because it breaks color right okay. why does that one look like the color is more vibrant than this one probably is so they use a double roller when they print yeah and more times than not the ink aren't, aren't set to the same color tone oh Whoa. oh my god okay so those are the crap same. okay like, look even here you know this one's even right more those all came in in the same shipment in the same box. Crazy. <laughs> it's wild. <laughs> well, crap. All right. I'm gonna say this is gonna come back about an eight and eight five. Okay. This one is probably a seven because it also has this. Oh, hit yeah. us on that. What'd you find? You find more cool cars? Yeah. yeah. If he breaks something, let me know. All right. So what are you guessing on that one? Color breaks. Color up. I'm gonna say a five, five, or a six. Okay. Just because there's a lot of random like finger bends all over the cover and stuff. I'm glad that you're documenting this. Yeah. Because I'll forget what I tell you. Yeah, I know, that's <laughs> why, and I know it's gonna take a while to get them, so it'll be exciting. Yeah. I'm gonna, t I'm gonna say that this is probably about an eight. Oh, okay. I think, I think this one is in better shape than this one. Oh, for sure. And I think this one's probably in the seven to seven five, and then this would probably be an eight. I think this could potentially sure. be it's between an eight and a nine. Okay. And that's know. the first one? Yeah. Nice. So you're going nine on that one, I'll eight, eight, on, eight and eight and a nine? nine. I seven, five to eight. Okay. Oh now this is a competition between the two I of mean, you. <laughs> I mean these are usually these usually grade pretty high. Just because they're, you know, the foil covers will, will really have. Yeah. It's it's a nine six nine eight. Cool. For All sure. right. Mm -hmm. Little stuff in the middle. I'm not, like, how are you seeing? I'm not even seeing. So I'm not looking get, or you seeing. Get it in the light oh of the yeah. Okay. Now, oh, yep. You can see like the end indentations. Yeah. yeah. The I mean the colors on it are great. You could press this. This would come back really high if you pressed it. Because you're only talking a couple. Of Four or five, yeah, seven. without without a press, it's probably like a 775. With a press, you're at least at an 85. Okay. Yeah, I can agree with that. Yeah. This one is probably, I would say probably an 758. Eight. A couple yeah. color breaks, but this is a good book. You said it was 75 on this one? 75 to an 8. Depends on, depends on your grader that day. Yep, this one's probably an 8.5 to a 9. Oh, nice, okay. Be my guess. Pages are great. If anything in this stack comes back a 9, I'll be happy. Yeah, these are some white pages in here for sure. Yeah, yeah. So you guys think that one's going to get a 9? 8.5 to a 9. Okay. Yeah. That's you. This one's pretty, I mean, this is probably at least another 8. I'm going to um, say a 7 on this guy. 7? Yeah, this one's a good yep. beat, so I'm gonna. Yeah, that's that's a five. Like five, five. I'd say five or five to six. Yeah. Okay. I think this would probably be. It just really depends on what they mark this down on, but with yeah, that corner, oh, that corner too. With that, probably a seven, five or eight. Yeah. So this is the book I'm most interested in getting. This is graded. Incredible shape too. Got one little finger bend right here. At least an eight five. I would think this is at least an 8.5. Okay, so that one don't grade because of the price tag. Why? Because they're going to murder you on the grade. So those two are no All right, last book. 
I'm going to take a guess. That's going to get a four. <laughs> so you're going to go with me four? I, th I think it's like a four, four, five. Okay. I am in Ann Arbor, Michigan right now. I dropped off comic books months ago, and a lot of them. I'm at State of Comics. Uh, I'm about to go in and find out what grades these comics uh, ended up. Uh, we're going to compare it to what these experts at State of Comics guessed that they would be. So let's see. Uh, don't forget, guys, like, subscribe, and comment. we got a big whatnot coming up. Here's the information for the whatnot and Alpha One Wrestling running very very huge events on this channel for free streaming live so make sure you subscribe sick yeah this is the one i got from you guys when i did the signing with um sergeant slaughter yeah <laughs> wow, came back 9.4. That's awesome. White pages. Very cool. All right. Ready. I'm ready. So we're all, we're about to Should reveal. Should we go from lowest grade to highest grade? Do you? Yeah, sure. All right. Yeah, I like that idea. There's nothing under a 6.5. Whoa, for real? Yeah, nothing. Came back under a 6.5. Okay. There's one 6.5, the rest are 7.5 or higher. All right, cool. So, all right. So this is... Uh, 6.5. 6.5. <laughs> yeah. This is the ASM 289. Oh! So that came back as 6.5. Hell yes. Oh, that's awesome. So that's the oh, original yeah. MMP uh, movie. What's this number NN? Um, that's just because it's a one shot. Oh, I gotcha. Okay. So it doesn't actually have a number. So this one came back as yes. 7. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. It's my favorite comic book cover of all time. Whoa! Amazing. I couldn't tell you the difference. Got a seven oh, five cool. on. Sweet Christmas cover. Very mm -hmm. important. Santa didn't give that away. Another seven five. Oh, Batman Returns. I dude, I literally forgot that I sent any what I brought, what I put. This is awesome. Um, the ASM two ninety six. I came back a nine. Jeez. Nine two ASM two ninety. Peter Parker proposes to Mary Jane Watson. Uh, that's ASM 307, that came back in 92. Uh, the Mortal Kombat came back in 92. Yeah, I, I was think, so worried about the Mortal Kombat I think ones. this one was pretty spot on for what we said. So that came back in 92. Yeah. We'll go Mortal Kombat, The Blood and Thunder, that came back in 94. Oh. I like that you're you you're so excited. It's making me excited. Yeah, I'm like really curious as to how accurate. This is. <laughs> but this one you'll be very happy with, I think, because I know you really love this book. So you got a nine two on the number one and a nine zero on the. the oh, two. yes, yes, hell yes, dude, that is awesome. I uh, kind of anticipated this. I'm pretty sure we called this one. Um, it was the Batman 423, the foil, and that one came back in 9.8. No! You called this one. It was such worth the wait, especially since I forgot everything that I sent out. Like, even this, like, I didn't even know I had this. And yet, and here it is. Welcome to State of Comics, guys. We're located at 575 Forest Avenue in Plymouth, Michigan. Uh, you can also shop online, stateofcomics.com. And uh, we carry a little bit of everything, uh, but our big thing is back issues and new comics. And we also have a great wall of, of uh, more expensive comics as well. Facebook.com slash data comics, Instagram.com slash data comics, uh, X slash Twitter dot com slash data comics. So everything is just straight up state of comics. Awesome. So, <laughs> easy to find. Yeah. Easy to find. <laughs>
And I bought a Game Boy Color. This one right here. Oh, yeah. The truth is I bought a Game Boy Color because I wanted to play the original Pokemon. Not a revamped version, not an updated version, not a re-released version. No, the original. Uh, I had blue as a kid growing up, eventually getting yellow, which was amazing because it was in color and had Pikachu follow around Ash or whatever you named your character. But yeah, I wanted to play that. Turns out I should never start a collection for one thing because um, I now own a lot of Game Boy games. <laughs> Let's take you on the road with Ethan Page shopping around with some Game Boy Color games. Carding before. I mean, all this is cool. with my daughter for about three hours caught a bunch of pokemon the battery is dead which means you can't save the game in these old ass cartridges so that went absolutely nowhere uh, in the shops i ended up finding this power rangers game ninja turtles toy story racer Tony Hawk Pro Skater. Tarzan. This weird Disney racing game. I got a fantastic deal on this X-Men Mutant Wars, which I've played, and it is fun. Always love buying Rampage for any system. It's just a classic game, I love the game. I grabbed Mulan, and I grabbed this WWF Superstars game. And a World Cup soccer game where all their heads are massive and it's very easy to score, especially when you pick Brazil. It's a big Ronaldo fan, number nine. Anyways, so we got a bunch of stuff added on here. 
Uh, I do plan on shopping in the future to grab some new stuff. So in the next toy hunt, yeah, I'm hitting up an awesome shop in Des Moines, Iowa, and it's badass, huge store. And I picked up some video games, some toys, and some fun stuff. So next week we'll drop that video. But I did tell you why I bought this. Easy. Now go. Go. Go! Oh, this way! This way! Yeah! Extra points! <laughs> With games like Super Mario Brothers now in color, you might actually forget where you are. Game Boy Color. Get into it. Yes. I got a working copy. Pokemon Blue. Original. The battery works. Saves the game. And I've been playing for about 20 hours. It pains me to admit that as a 34 year old man. But the nostalgia is too real. It's too fun and uh, I'm having a blast. And uh, for those wondering, yeah, I've caught over 30 Pokemon. In case you're wondering. My wife makes fun of me every time she sees me walk by with uh, my Game Boy in my hand. She says, oh, there he is, catching them all. But I did catch a Snorlax. So that's it. That's the video, guys. Thank you so much. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment. And uh, look forward to some new Toy Hunt videos coming soon. Uh, look forward to some new backstage wrestling travel vlogs coming soon. Um, those ones will be on Sunday. The Toy Hunts will be dropping during the week, in the middle of the week, whenever that is. But the wrestling content will now be on Sundays. Because we're live on May 19th. Live on May 19th. Immortal Kombat 8. Massive show. Can't wait. And don't forget, April 28th, live on whatnot, auctionego.com. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys down the line.